how to download the LibreOffice for your Windows 11 computer system. So hey guys, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can download and install the LibreOffice application for your Windows 11 computer system. So in order to install the LibreOffice, the first thing that you need to do is open any web browser of your choice be it the google chrome microsoft edge mozilla firefox or any other web browser that you prefer so for the sake of this demonstration i will be using the google chrome web browser so once you have opened your web browser you need to search for libreoffice download and once you have searched for it simply hit the enter button and you will see this first result that says download download LibreOffice from LibreOffice.org so LibreOffice.org is the official website to download LibreOffice from so click on to this first link and you will be landed into the official LibreOffice website now from here it is giving me the versions the latest version being the version 25.2.3 so if you want some older version then you can simply scroll down and you can also download the previous version which was 24.8.7 and here it has automatically detected my operating system which is the windows 64 bit but in case if you want to change the operating system you can click onto this drop down arrow and it will list out different operating systems like linux and mac os as well so currently i'm gonna let it remain to windows 64 bit and then click onto this download button right here and from here you can say and from here you can see that the download has automatically started for the libreoffice and the setup is around 348 megabytes so in order to install the LibreOffice, we will first need to completely download this installation setup and once the installation setup completely downloads, we will use this installation setup to extract the LibreOffice application for our Windows 11 computer system. So now let us patiently wait for this setup installation exe file to get downloaded and here you can see that the download process has been successfully completed so let's click onto this open button to open the installation media and here it says welcome to the installation wizard for libreoffice 25.2.3.2 so click onto this next button and from here it is asking me to choose a setup type there are basically two types of setup the first one is the typical setup and the second one is the custom setup so in a typical setup it the libreoffice will be installed with the default components including user interface languages and spelling dictionaries matching your current language settings and if you go for the custom installation then you can choose the program features you want installed and where they will be installed so if you are a beginner i will recommend that you choose the typical option and then click on the next button and from here you have these two further option the first one is to create a shortcut on desktop and the another one is load libreoffice during system startup so i will not check the second option but i can check the first option and then i'm gonna click onto this install button and it might ask you for permission before starting to install and you need to click yes onto this and here you can see that the installation has been successfully started and now we will need to wait for the installation process to finish and once the installation process will finish we will be able to launch our LibreOffice version 25.2.3.2 in our Windows 11 computer system so now here you can see this dialog box that says installation wizard completed the installation wizard had successfully installed libreoffice 
click finish to exit the wizard so simply click onto this finish button and now the LibreOffice has been successfully installed into your Windows 11 computer system so now let us try to access the application by moving our cursor towards the bottom of the screen and onto the search bar search for LibreOffice and under the best match you can see the LibreOffice application so simply double click onto the LibreOffice application and here you can see the LibreOffice starting up so let's wait for the application to load up completely and here is the interface for the LibreOffice application in Windows 11 you can open file from this particular button right here and load other documents so that's it for this video if this video was helpful to you consider giving this video a like to tell us in the comments how it went for you or if you have any suggestions or questions to ask and also don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel for more such exciting and helpful video content thanks for watching and have a nice day